Okay, so being a little bit biased towards the San Diego stuff, I think I'm overly excited about this one. Inter you want to introduce yourself? Yeah, that's nice. The, you're now the you're now the biggest football star in town. I think after the Chargers left. Yeah, big like. Team. You are like, the guy. You are like, yeah. You're now the de facto like. Yeah. You're the you're the new Joey Bosa. Uh, <laughs> you want to introduce yourself to San Diego and, and let everyone know who you are. Uh, my name is Don Guadino. I come from Olympia High School and I'm attending San Diego State University. There we go. Staying at home. So, what was that decision like to stay here instead of going elsewhere? Um, honestly, it was it was a hard decision because I, I was recruited by a few different schools, but. The, just how they recruited me and how honest they were with how they were, um, what it was, what I was going to be going into, was what kind of made the decision even better. And just being able to have my family at all the games too, that's going to mean a lot to me. So, just kind of all around, like academically, um, football-wise, and just outside, like being able to be around my family still is still a huge factor that and why I chose San Diego State. In all seriousness, Christian was kind of joking about the Chargers thing, but seriously, you guys are the number one football team now in town. So, is that going to be even cooler next year, being the best football team in San Diego? Yeah, it's it's huge. It's kind of like there's there's not a better time to be a come Aztec. Right. So that's what kind of our recruiting class is kind of thinking about right now. It's just thinking about how what perfect time it is for all of us to come in um, and show San Diego what what actual San Diego State football is all about. Now let's give a little just a little brief for the people that are meeting you for the first time that are San Diego State fans. Tell us about your style of play, where they're going to see you on the O-line, what you bring to the team. Uh, they recruited me for center, so if I can prove that I'm good enough to start, then I'll play. Um, how I play is just aggressive. You always see me go 100%, and I'm going to play until the whistle blows, and if that guy goes down before the whistle, then so be it. Just keep going. <laughs> yeah. Ground, yeah. Ground. Oh, another, uh, another one. So I've gotten the privilege of interviewing uh, Coach Long before. He's a character. I, I think he's great. Uh, what are your thoughts about the coaching staff and Coach Long? Um, honestly, the coaching staff is probably the best I've ever been recruited by. Um, just how honest they are and being able to say that nothing's guaranteed it's all they're going to give me an opportunity to see what I can do with that opportunity and just kind of like that, that challenge that they gave us as a, uh, a class is what's the biggest thing that stood out to them is or for me to them is that they're so laid back like they they, they be their self around you they don't try to put on a mask just because it's recruiting season and stuff like that um, and just for the fact of that is what kind of made my decision more more easy to make let's talk about that decision when you finally said we're going to San Diego State you, you you sign your name on the dotted line. What what was what were your emotions? Honestly, it was just like a weight was lifted off of me because this whole recruiting process, all the uh, the media and stuff like that, it's it's been a lot of weight and just making sure that um, someone doesn't take your spot and stuff like that. Just the, the biggest thing is just the stress coming off of all of us and just being able to say that like, all right, we're at Aztec and it's finally over. Let's just get down to business and get ready for the next fall. And how many of the guys in your class are you already in contact with and talking about next year with? Uh, well, I've already met a couple committed guys like Tariq Thompson, uh, TJ Sullivan, Shane Coleman. Um, those three guys are probably the closest guys that I'm with right now. Um, Cedric Lakalaka from Hawaii, we met him on the visit that we went. Ooh, that's a great name. He said that name one more time. <laughs> Cedric Lakalaka. That's an awesome name. Yeah, <laughs> it's a sick name. Um, but yeah, we met. Uh, we met a couple times, but I met uh, Cedric at the visit, and just all of them are huge, super cool people, and just the, San Diego State has done a really good job of not only recruiting football players, but good people too. So I gotta ask you one, one more question, You're gonna, since you are so close, are you gonna be doing the laundry, or are you gonna be doing, bringing the laundry home? Uh, I'm gonna be doing the laundry. There we go, attaboy, <laughs> boy. make the family proud. Yeah. I, I think one, one more question to go with the closeness, how, how much does that give you a leg up on transitioning to college football with you're already there, you're already in your town where you're gonna be going to school? Uh, honestly, it gives me such a good foundation to be able to transition, kind of hit the feet, hit my hit the ground uh, running. Um, I'll be able to stay in contact with SDSU coaches. It's, like, it's going to be a lot more convenient than me having to go out of state to go talk to them and stuff like that. So if I ever have anything, any questions, I could just go straight to them. And it's so convenient for me to be able to uh, bounce things off and be able to know what I need to do bef in order to get myself ready for the uh, college football uh, demands. And are you almost kind of an ambassador for the rest of the kids who are from outside of San Diego? Like, oh, you should you know, eat, eat at this place, go to this place, blah, blah, blah. Do you feel kind of like responsibility? Yeah, are you going to be guiding them to the best yeah. Mexican food here in San Diego? <laughs> well, they actually have a really good Mexican spot right by San Diego State. It's called uh, Trujillo's. All right, there it's you go. super good. <laughs> Very nice. San Diego State. 
it, it might have been hyperbole saying that they are the biggest thing in San Diego now. It might not be. We're about to find out with this class. Dom, thank you thank very you. much. Best of luck to you this Ooh, that's season. A handshake right there.